think the way that we began the service is a biblical way. By the Word of God, by the Bible, we're a Bible-believing church. Yes. And uh, we're trying to practice New Testament worship. Um, the Bible said, enter into his gates with thanksgiving, and enter his courts with praise. Amen. And then the Bible said, let this mind be in you, which also was in Christ Jesus, who being in the form of God, thought it not robbery, to be made equal with God. Yes, Those are two biblical scriptures, just as many more. But I, I want us to write down, everyone that physically can, rise to your feet. Why do you want that, Brother Marlowe? I want completely body, spirit, soul, and uh, mind unity. As we begin to pray and ask God to help the church and uh, lead the church and guide the church in the critical times in which we live. Um, we have, we, we are believing God for Brother Wallace here. Amen. Amen. He, he's on the list. He's uh, part of us. And we're believing God. And a tremendous amount of faith was manifested here Sunday night by the elders of the church and by the church. And I believe, now this is a strange statement, and you can misinterpret it if you want to. How do you believe healing, Brother Marlowe? I believe healing when we ask him. Right. And I believe when we ask it shall be given. Yes. Healing is not in the visible eye presence of your eye. Amen, healing is in the will and commandment of God. Yes. And you believe and that's all God requires of you. I believe Brother Lee Wallace is healed. Yes. In the name of Jesus, I believe. I believe. Now, someone said, but Brother Marlowe, what if? I'm not dealing with what if. I'm not dealing with what if. Look, you can't deal with what if and faith at the same time. Did you, did, did you get that? You, you can't deal with what if and faith at the same time. You have to believe and that's it. You have to believe and that's it. That's like saying, what if there is not a God? The Bible didn't ask you to believe that way. The Bible said, He that cometh to God must believe. Must believe that He is. I don't see Him. I can't, I don't know. I've never. He is. He is. Praise the name of the Lord. And so tonight we're going to believe God with this Bible faith. And we're going to come before his uh, presence with thanksgiving. We're going to enter his courts with praise tonight. We know we go to first heaven. We go to second heaven. And we know eventually we will be around the throne of God by faith. In third heaven itself. Praise the name of the Lord. So we're going to enter the courts with praise. And gates with thanksgiving is courts with praise. And we're going to believe God for Brother Wallace. We're going to believe God for every uh, Brother Frost, I talked to him just before service tonight, Brother Leon, and uh, had a good prayer with him on the phone, talked to him, went down to see him, but we missed him. You missed him today, didn't you? Yeah, down there. But Brother Frost is recovering, and he's getting better from what he told me. He's getting stronger. Praise Not too Lord. long over here, Praise and uh, Brother Frost is getting stronger. Praise so we're going to pray uh, and ask God to uh, help Brother Frost, yeah. Brother Wallace, we got an email, I've heard no more, Facebook, I understand, that Brother Lee Ander Ray, the former pastor of Kingsport, Tennessee, and with Brother Lloyd Goodwin for many, many years, uh, right hand of Brother Goodwin in his ministry, uh, Brother Lee Ander Ray is, uh, was in a hospital in Africa. He's over in Africa, and he's in a hospital. I don't know the latest. Have you heard Brother Steve? Yes. Have any he's, more? he's home and feeling real good. He's home and feeling real good. That's that, an answer to prayer. that today. Lord. All right. He's still over in Africa. He'll be there until probably November, October, latter part of October, November. Be back over here. Let's pray for Brother Andrew Ray. Ask God to help him. I talked with Brother Jared Manning from Kingsport, Tennessee yesterday. And Brother Jared Manning said he wanted us to pray for him, his assembly. So we'll pray for them. Let's pray for the uh, Shepherdsville campground coming up, um, not this weekend, but um, a week from uh, this Saturday, they'll, uh, week, week from this Monday, coming Monday, 
they'll begin their meeting there. And we'll pray for Shepherdsville and the uh, people of God there, the body of Christ there, uh, family of God. And let's pray for the rest of the sick and the rest of the afflicted and anyone in need in our assembly. Let's pray. Thank let's you, pray. God. Prayer is a strong conversation between you and God with your closet shut. Enter in your closet. That's your mind. Enter into your closet and pray there in secret before God. God, see your mind and your heart and believe in God, and God will answer. God does answer. Now, I'll take any special, pertinent, needed request right now. Anyone, let me look out across. Sister. Pray for my brother Rick. Brother Rick tonight needs prayer. Okay. Uh, will I get to see him? Um, we'll, we'll, we hope, all right? I'll talk with you about that. Praise God. All right. Pray that uh, she gets her strength back. 
We, we don't want to see her among the messy. All right. Praise the name of the Lord. These are our brothers. These are our sisters. I, this is only part of the family of God tonight. Why don't we just forget about others? And they just around us now. In the name of Jesus, Lord. In the name of Jesus, Lord. In the name of Jesus. We enter into our closet of prayer. And we come in first with thanksgiving and rejoicing. We come in rejoicing because you're the Lamb. Uh, you're the Lamb of Calvary. We come in because we know this is a time of testing for the people of God. We know that the people of God are going to be tried and tested. We know everything in the world that can come against the church of the living God will come against it because we are the peculiar chosen regenerated people called by your name called in the blood bathed in your blood lord we're here tonight as a church to not let anything hinder us from being in one mind one accord as part of the body of christ we lift our voices and we bless the body of Christ, and, and we pray for our brothers and our sisters, and we pray tonight for our assemblies around about us. We pray for the ministry. Oh, but more than that, we pray, oh God, for the sick and the afflicted. And we know that we ask in faith, believing, and we trust you. We trust the name. We trust your holy name. We, we trust the holy name of Jesus. Lord, we don't ask in vain. We don't call upon you in vain. Uh, we don't come here and leave here disappointed. We don't feel that we're only just making words but that we're earnestly tonight praying. Elijah prayed and the heavens gave forth the rain. Oh God, he prayed again uh, and it, it, it stopped. Uh, we can be as that man Elijah. You said we can pray with a fervent prayer, an effectual, fervent prayer. Oh, God, tonight, look down upon the people of God. We believe that while we're praying, the Holy Ghost can come down and touch every one of the people of God that's here present. And we believe those that are present, those whose names were called, can feel the presence of the Lord and feel the joy of the Holy Ghost. We pray tonight for a desire and a zeal to get in the hearts of your people. We will not be discouraged. We will not be intimidated. We will not back up. We will not retreat. We believe in the power and the glory of our Jesus. Praise your name for your presence. Praise your name for your presence. Praise your name for your presence. Oh, we thank you tonight. We can feel the strength of the Lord, the strength of the Holy Ghost. We can feel it right here present in our midst. And we know the power of prayer. We know that it is right to call upon you. We know that you hear us. We know that you listen. We know the listening post tonight is being occupied by our Savior and our Lord and our Mediator, our High Priest. And, oh, we give you the praise. We give you the praise right now with one mind and one accord. We lift your name. And we call the name of Jesus. Oh, this is a Holy Ghost church tonight, Lord. We are a Holy Ghost land of believers. We believe in the gospel. We believe in the New Testament. We believe in the grace of God. We believe in the power of God. And there is no defeat in serving you, Lord. You will bless our houses. You will bless our businesses. You will bless, Lord, your people. And I believe you tonight. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. We give you the praise. We give you the praise, hallelujah, 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 precious Lord, precious Lord, precious Lord, why don't we just go ahead and receive our offering saints of God.